What's up, guys? It's Ben from Lecture Lexicals. And I'm Matthew. And today we're going to be talking about, um, well, today we're having a couple videos of some new stuff that we got in that he's going to string up. And we'll do a live streaming video in another review. Uh, but first off, we're going to talk about this gray, dark gray Maverick tank. This is the uh, Maverick defensive head. You can probably tell from the shape. Um, overall, super light for a defensive head because the cutout um, inside of it. Um, we like Mavericks a lot, so because mm -hmm. so, they're, in my opinion, the best head in the cross. But as you can see, the nice logo cutout um, right there. Lots of sidewall holes, so that's a good thing. Um, I like the side of it. And the stiffness is what makes it defensive head. Super stiff, very strong. So, this is the Maverick Tank. I've been using the Maverick Tank for almost a year. I really like it. This one's almost a year old, and it's still very stiff. But I decided to retire it because I messed it up pretty bad in some areas. I actually dyed this one black. This was white. But that just kind of got too boring for me. And so, this fiber tank is gray. I'm going to gr put gray hero mesh on it. And I re really like this head. It's very stiff. Good for poke checks and ground balls. Hitting people very hard in the stomach with it. That's, I do that a lot. <laughs> and I, really, I just really like this head. It's a gray head. Yeah. Anything else? Very easy to string, but it's kind of, you, whenever you string it, you can't really get like a true high pocket. You kind of get like a mid, mid-low pocket. So it's good for deep holes. Mm-hmm. Overall. So that was the review of the gray Maverick tank. And we're about to string that up for you guys. Well, he is. <laughs> so, yeah, I'll see you guys later.